we've talked about this so often, um, what has to happen in 2023, whether it be on the energy front, whether it be on the political front, a lot of worries coming into the next few months about the price cap on Russian oil, the energy situation, stability. What is your greatest fear moving into 2023? I, I, I really think that we need to focus on collaboration, cooperation, avoiding more geopolitical tensions and calling for calm and political solutions to geopolitical tensions. Uh, we made our position very clear on these uh, issues, um, whether it is in the General Assembly in the United Nations or uh, other forums. And Saudi Arabia has been facilitating and a lot of that dialogue we'll with Russia. We continue to do that, but also we wanted to focus on our economy and what matters for our people, because not that is not only important for the Saudis. It is important for the region. The region need calm. They need the region need to focus on economic reform, which is delivering for its people. Do you see Saudi Arabia as a conduit in terms of speaking to China, speaking to Russia? Because those I are difficult conversations for the West. I would say absolutely yes. We have a very strategic relationship with the U.S. and we have a strategic relationship with China, and we think we can bridge the gap. 